Hello and welcome to Engineering Simple. This video will talk about pure capacitive loads. So the capacitive current is equal to the peak value of the current times cosine 2 pi times frequency times time plus theta plus 90 degrees. And we'll see why we have the 90, 90 degree term. The RMS value of the voltage is equal to the peak value of the voltage divided by the square root of 2, and this is only valid for sinusoidal voltages. The RMS value of the current is equal to the peak value of the current divided by the square root of 2, and this is only valid for sinusoidal currents. The reactance of the capacitance is equal to 1 over 2 pi times frequency times capacitance. So the capacitive current is equal to the voltage divided by minus J times the reactance of the capacitance. So we have negative J in the in the denominator, so if we move it up, we'll change the sign. So that's why we have voltage divided by reactance times J. J is nothing else but uh, an angle of 90 degrees. So this equation tells us that the current leads the voltage by 90 degrees. So if we look at the graph to the right, so you can see if we go counterclockwise, the current leads the voltage by 90 degrees. Note the current and voltage are RMS values. So usually in AC circuits, the subscript RMS is dropped. So the average power absorbed by the capacitor is zero. So a, cap a pure capacitor consumes zero power. Thank you for watching this video. And don't forget to subscribe to Engineering Simple to receive more videos. Have a good day.